you at this point? Uh, no, I mean, I think uh, a lot of it has been spent recovering, you know, body, just taking care of our bodies, and then uh, a lot has been focused on game plan, and, you know, I think this, this is the first time um, our team has known this many plays um, this well um, all season. Walking into this arena today, I mean, is it starting to sink in? Playoffs starts now today. Yeah, I mean, it, it, for us, I think it all started sinking in yesterday when we were watching all the games go on, and uh, that was really fun to watch. Just uh, you know, every game was was <clears throat> pretty much a grinded out game, with, with the exception of one, and. Um, you know, all the games were lower scoring and, and really physical, and, and so, um, you know, that kind of got us locked into it. Obviously, everything just kind of starts over in the playoffs, but, you know, you guys are an underdog. Does that kind of add a motivational factor at all as far as tracking the world? I mean, we've been we've been in this position the whole season, so, um, you know, we're, we're really just focused on what we're doing as a team, and, and um, to be honest, we're not really too concerned with everything else on the outside. You know, I think uh, we feel like when we play the way we're supposed to play, we can compete with, uh, you know, any team and uh, we can be competitive and so um, that's what we're planning to do. One of your most impressive wins was against them. Anything vividly about that contest in Houston that you remember? Uh, yeah, I mean we just lost a lot of players right before the game and um, that was right. Uh, we had just found out as we were walking onto the court so um, that was an emotional night. Um, and uh, in terms of the game itself, uh, you know, James had a, had a career high and, and I think for us uh, as a team we just played uh, we played for each other, we played with each other, and uh, I think that was the main takeaway that we saw on film, too. You saw how the game just really grinded out, and I know you guys have said you're not going to grind it out, you just going to keep playing the game. Do you think that now, watching those games yesterday, the playoff dynamic does change? Oh, we're definitely going to have to grind it out, I don't think, uh, I think we all um, understand that. We just, uh, at the same time, hope that we can impose our offensive system and, and our spread and our space and our um, pace. Um, we want to be able to do that, but you know, on the defensive end, on the boards, um, on loose balls, it's definitely going to be grinded out. Was the Oklahoma City game one of the better examples of pace and space and moving the ball? Definitely moving the ball. Um, I'm not sure how many points we got in transition against them, but I know that um, the ball was zipping around and we had a lot of open slot corner uh, threes. We had a lot of... Um, you know, pocket passes and, and things like that. Just a lot of different looks where uh, indicative of a team that's moving the ball really well.